In the annals of technological history, certain innovations stand out as transformative milestones that reshaped our daily lives. The Betamax, introduced in 1975 by Sony, is undoubtedly one of these revolutionary inventions. This video explores the history, impact, and eventual decline of the Betamax format, which forever altered the way people consumed and recorded video content. The 1970s were a period of tremendous innovation and experimentation in the field of consumer electronics. The television had firmly established itself as the centerpiece of home entertainment, but the idea of recording television programs for later viewing was still in its infancy. In this context, the Betamax was conceived and brought to life by Sony. Sony had a reputation for pushing the boundaries of technology, and the Betamax was no exception. Introduced in 1975, it was the first widely available home video recording system. Betamax used half-inch magnetic tapes to record and play back television programs and movies. The initial model, the Betamax SL7200, was an impressive feat of engineering and it quickly garnered attention for its innovative features. The Betamax success can be attributed to several key features and advantages that set it apart from other video recording technologies of the time. Compactness and portability. One of Betamax's standout features was its compact design. Unlike the bulkier VCR, video cassette recorder systems that would later emerge as competitors, Betamax machines were relatively small and portable. This made them more accessible to the average consumer as they could easily fit into a home entertainment setup. High quality recording. Betamax boasted excellent video and audio quality, far surpassing what was available through other recording methods at the time. It used a high-resolution video system, providing viewers with sharp and clear images, and the audio quality was also superior. Time shifting. Betamax introduced the concept of time shifting, allowing users to record television programs and watch them at their convenience. This feature revolutionized the way people consumed media as it liberated them from the constraints of broadcast schedules. Ease of use. Betamax was designed with user friendliness in mind. Its straightforward controls and intuitive interface made it accessible to a wide range of consumers, even those who were not technologically inclined. The introduction of the Betamax had a profound cultural impact altering the way people engaged with television and film. Here are some of the notable effects it had on society. Home Entertainment Revolution. Betamax marked the beginning of the home entertainment revolution. Families could now watch their favorite TV shows and movies at their leisure, leading to a shift away from communal TV watching and a move toward personalized viewing experiences. Rise of the Video Rental Industry. The Betamax format laid the foundation for the video rental industry. Videotape rental stores began popping up across the country, offering consumers access to a vast library of movies and TV shows. This trend would later be expanded upon and perfected by the VHS format. Preservation of personal memories. Beyond its impact on entertainment, Betamax allowed individuals to record and preserve personal memories. Home videos became a cherished way for families to capture special moments and events from birthdays to vacations. Betamax's success was not without its share of legal challenges. In 1976, Universal Studios sued Sony, alleging copyright infringement due to the home recording capabilities of the Betamax. The case, known as Sony Corp of America v. Universal City Studios, Inc., eventually reached the U.S. Supreme Court, which ruled in favor of Sony, stating that home recording for personal use was legal. Despite its initial success and cultural impact, Betamax ultimately lost the format war to VHS, Video Home System. Several factors contributed to Betamax's decline. Longer recording time. VHS offered longer recording times than Betamax, while Betamax tapes typically had a maximum recording time of one hour per side, VHS tapes could hold two or more hours of content. 
This gave VHS an advantage, especially for recording movies or extended television programs. VHS secured support from major movie studios, leading to a more extensive library of movies available in the VHS format. Betamax, on the other hand, struggled to secure similar partnerships, limiting its content offerings. Market Saturation VHS gained momentum as more manufacturers produced VHS-compatible devices and tapes. This led to greater market saturation, making VHS more affordable and accessible to consumers. While Betamax may have lost the battle, its legacy endures as a pioneer in home video recording technology. It played a crucial role in shaping the way we interact with media and its influence can still be seen in the modern era of digital streaming and content consumption. The Betamax will forever be remembered as a technological marvel that brought the magic of time-shifting and personal video recording into our homes.